as we look at the work of Pacific Women Lead around the leadership of women in our region at all levels of society, um, greater equity for our, our, our women, and, and how that translates at regional level, but also down to the community. So the vision is that there is a sustained transformation that takes place in the Pacific that enables uh, the leadership and equity of women to be not only affected, but celebrated, where it becomes a matter of Pacific pride that we're able to achieve these things. I come from a different space, particularly in terms of the faith communities. So um, given that 90% um, of our Pacific are people of faith, uh, or uh, you know, predominant uh, spiritual worldviews, I think that perspective is something that's very important. Um, and uh, to provide um, you know, thinking around how, how do we engage, how does Pacific Women Lead engage with the, the faith communities, what are the shifts and trends happening in that space that can also translate to um, the other sectors. This uh, is an opportunity for me to learn more about the processes that crop agencies such as SPC and other partners um, have to go through in terms of trying to make the work, uh, this important work happen. And so I look forward to what I learned from, uh, from this experience um, and also the relationships and partnerships and collaborations that will extend from beyond this governance level to actually engaging with, with others on the board.